Meredith asked him about Herman. Aaron had the best night for Herman. What were you seeing from him? Um, I thought he was. I thought he was okay, just not overly sharp. Um, you know, the walk to walk to the to Grossman. You know, a little uncharacteristic. You know, usually he's he's pounds the strike zone, so losing him there and then then Olson. You know, I got to look at look back, but I don't think it was a terrible pitch, kind of up and in that he got to and was able to keep fair, and then a change up that Canna got. Then I thought he settled in actually pretty well. Um, you know, maybe not his best stuff overall, but, um, you know, I thought he pitched better than certainly his line will end up. You went out there with Stevie Donahue in that fifth inning. Was it just a matter of him slipping, or was it more than that? Yeah, he just, <clears throat> the hole on the mound was a little funky, and he, he rolled over it a little bit, but um, I think he's fine. You then put him back out there the next inning. You had somebody warming. Was there any consideration to making a pitching change then? Yeah, I was actually going to do it with Piscotti. Um... um but, you know, he got the strikeout, and I, I really felt like his stuff was fine. Then he gets ahead of Piscotti with two strikes, and, um, you know, I, I think is trying to bounce the breaking ball and leaves it in the middle of the plate on a two-strike count that obviously ends up hurting him. And then, uh, you know, Lowe obviously came in and, and pitched pretty well behind him. But, yeah, I considered it, but um, felt like <clears throat> that wasn't necessarily – the spot I wanted to put low in there, especially when I felt like Herman had a little bit left in the tank. How good was it to see Judge pull a ball like that? Um, yeah, it was good to see him really, really obviously destroy one there. Um, you know, I even thought, you know, it, you know, obviously the last couple of days for him have been been better days at the plate where he's gotten some results and hit some balls on the screws. Um, and then I thought, you know, I, I was encouraged, even his first at bat where he struck out, I thought he got some really good swings off where I thought he was completing his move. And, you know, he just, he happened to punch. But then to to really get into one like he did was, was good to see and hopefully something that he continues to to build that momentum. Your offense isn't held down very often. What was Bailey doing that made it so tough out there? Yeah, that's twice now that he's pitched well against us. Um, earlier in the year with Kansas City, he, he kind of held us down too. Um, you know, we were able to, you know, he, did, he didn't really walk. I don't know if he walked anyone, but he didn't seem to walk a lot of guys. We got a lot of hits today. I think we had 10 hits, but we just, you know, couldn't get that hit to kind of put us over the top or, um, you know, so there's been a couple of days of that where we've had some opportunities that we haven't been able to, to, to cash in.